Rope clouds are most often found along the boundary between cold air and warm air, like an advancing cold front or an outflow boundary left behind by a supercell thunderstorm. This textbook rope cloud here stretched across the sky for miles and had horizontal rotation caused by the sinking air on the cold side of that boundary and the uh, rising air on the warm side of that boundary. This rope cloud was left behind by a tornadic supercell in northeastern Colorado that dropped a state record sized hailstone here in Colorado in excess of five inches in diameter and all of that rain cooled air produced by that thunderstorm was left behind it in its wake and that created an outflow boundary that separated that rain cooled air from the warm air off to the south and this beautiful rope cloud formed along that interface between those two temperatures and that showed the position of that outflow boundary. Often thunderstorms will develop along these outflow boundaries and if other ingredients are in place it can stretch that horizontal spin into the vertical and can even lead to a tornado. Our tornado Northwest of Yuma, Colorado, coming out of the rain on the backside of this thing. 